I've been working with new learning technology for more than 20 years now. So using a technology like Second Life is new to me, but the ideas of using technology for learning is not. Second Life is a web-based, three-dimensional virtual world in which users, or residents as they're called, interact with each other through avatars in a similar style to a 3D game. The difference here though is that it's not a game, it's a virtual existence where residents meet other residents, socialise, participate in activities, they can trade, and of course most significantly for us, have the potential to learn. The higher education students of today are very much used to using new technology. In fact, they've been called the digital natives. So I think what is a success is being able to show students that we are joining the world of Web2 and that they can come and experience the university in a whole variety of new ways. The Second Life Media Zoo is a joint project between ourselves at 2.4 Learning and the Beyond Distance Research Alliance based at the University of Leicester. And it's essentially an immersive teaching and research environment in Second Life. Our hope is that it will act as a virtual showcase for a range of Leicester's e-learning research initiatives, that it will provide a virtual environment for new possibilities for collaboration, that it will be a place for experimentation with new approaches to teaching and learning, and to facilitate further research into learning through virtual environments. I hope that within, say, five years, Operating in Second Life will become as normal as walking in the lecture theatre with all the advantages that it might bring to our university and to others. So at the end of the day, this is the place where many people are now congregating and education needs to be there.